Hi folks, it's Adam from Cube3 here, and today we have an unboxing of the Bofell Compact Bluetooth Soundbar from Majority Audio. So, some of you will have seen a few photos of the box when it first arrived. It was a very nice surprise. So what I want to do now is just take you through how it looks. So there you go, so you see Bofell Majority Compact Bluetooth Soundbar. That's what it looks like. Comes with three year warranty. There's the Majority logo. We can see on the back there again, Majority Bofell built-in subwoofer. Better bass response for a more immersive audio experience. It has Bluetooth connectivity, so you can easily connect and play from your Bluetooth compatible device, which we will test later. It has USB and AUX aux playback, so you can listen to your own media from your device with the plug and play aux and USB ports. Now that's interesting. I think I'll be able to test that later with the switch. I have the U Green, can you see that there? The U Green Bluetooth adapter, which I can use on my switch to test out the Bluetooth connectivity. But I also have a standard, is it three and a half inch um, audio cable that I can use for the AUX playback. Also, it says here, remote control for convenient control over your audio playback settings. And that's how it can look very nicely in someone's living room with nice wooden floors and the nice desk with a lamp at the side. And as you can see there, it fits very nicely on top, out of the way, doesn't stand out. Compact, fits in with the setting very nicely indeed. What's on there, there's just the logo again, and on the bottom of the box, nothing. Okay, so let's get this open. Oh, look at this. That sounded very much like someone from the, some mothers do have him. Oh, the carry-on movies. Oh, Matron. Let's have a look in here. So how did we do? We tend to see these standard cards, just give some feedback about the company. Thank you for purchasing a majority product. Your feedback is really important to us and we'd love to know what you think. If you can spare a minute or two, please leave us a product review on Amazon. And there we go, we have a reminder. If you register online today, your product will receive free extended warranty and get lifetime technical support. Fantastic. What else do we have in here? There are some batteries in there. There's the majority website address, www.majority.co.uk. We have various cables in here. Some audio cables. We have a controller as well. So let's open up this first and get these out. So take out the little booklet. So this is the instruction guide for the Bofell Compact Bluetooth soundbar. And as mentioned, it comes batteries included, two AAA batteries for the controller. There is said remote control. There you go, power, power, mute, sound up, sound down, change tracks, pause or play, pair, which is useful if you want to pair with a new device, change modes, jazz, so those are, so those will be your equalizer options, that's very good. I'm wondering if mode will switch between Bluetooth, uh, USB and AUX. We can try that later. There's a majority sticker on the back, made in China, majority Bofell. So I'll take this out of its wrapper, if I can do this easily. Crinkle, crinkle, crinkle. And there we go. There we go. Very nice, slim, so you can see in terms of how slim that is. It's 
slimmer than my fatty finger. My sausage finger. There we go, there's your little infrared light there. And on the back, where the batteries will go in, which I'll sort out later for you. In fact, I'll leave that off. I will do that off camera shortly. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, here we go. In fact, we have the standard jack. Nice cable there. That saves me having to faff around. I can plug that into the headphone port of my switch later to test for you. And I can plug that into the Bofell Bluetooth bar. Brilliant. And what we have here are other audio cables. So that will go into your Bofell. And these will go into your TV. So on the back of your TV, you won't just have HDMI ports. And your TVs nowadays probably won't have a SCART port, but it will have the red and the white, and it will have a yellow video one. But obviously this isn't video, this is just purely your left and right channels for audio. Everything's normally color coded. On most TVs you will find it will be red and white, and then there's that yellow for the video. Yellow, good to see you. So there we go, that's really good that that's in there as well. Looks like quite a lengthy cable. If I untangle this, because cable length is always very important. So let's go. Here we go. Do, 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 do. <laughs> it does come to an end at some point. There you go. How's that? I don't know if you can. Uh, I'll just double that up. And then triple. So there you go. You can just see on the extent of the camera. So it's triple. Yeah, so I've doubled that up. That's unfolded. And then unfolded again. It is long indeed. I could skip with this. Skipping, skipping, skipping. But anyway, enough hijinks. Let's get this out. Okay, so can I pull this out first? Is this going to be the plug? I think this might be the plug. So this is one of the things I'm intrigued about, the power source. There we go, we have a plug. Out. This is the standard UK plug. It seems to be stuck together. Okay, so some of the devices that I've had recently have been compatible with other regions. So you you would connect this to the plug. So you'd have different connectors for different countries. There you have your port, your little power cable that goes in. I don't know if that has a specific name because there are different variations on these and they can be very fiddly you can get connectors for certain devices where you can actually pull this off and then put others on but so this i don't know it's quite important for you to have a look at this actually quite closely because i know some people will be thinking can i use this plug with other devices so just have a good look at that one there that's of any use to you. This is, I don't know if you can read it on there, there's AC DC adapter, input 100 to 240 volts, 50 to 60 hertz, one amp. It's a fully, fully sealed plug, so you can't pull it apart and play around with it and change the fuse. So presumably, it says Eve on there. Does it say Eve? Or does that say GVE? I think it might say GVE actually. Oh yeah, I think. I don't know. Can you see that there? I think that says GVE. Oh, I thought it was going to say Eve because you know my name's Adam, and I was like, oh, nice to meet you, Eve. <laughs> Did you get it, Adam? Eve? Yeah. Okay. Eden. There we go. Garden of Eden. Adam and Eve, let's unplug that. So we've got a long cable there. Long cable, unraveled. 
we'll get to that later. Sorry. Bang. Bump. So there we go. Box is out. Take these bits off. Woohoo! And here we have the sound bar itself. We just, oh, I keep banging everything. I'm sorry. I'm not very uh, light-handed with this. So there's a the majority logo. Well, you know, if ever, everybody was thinking, is this a sturdy device? Oh, pull this out. If you thought, was, is this a sturdy device? Well, yeah, I've already bumped and banged it a few times. So, so there's some little legs on it there. You can see it's very shiny. There you go, so it would sit. Let's put this box. like that and see if I can sit it on top for you so you can have a look no that's not gonna be a good idea <laughs> I'll put it in, in front Ooh, there we go how professional is that I'm throwing everything all over the place so here you go there's the Bofell majority sound bar very nice isn't it I'm just wondering if I can give you some sort of scale per perspective so in terms of how high it is. There's a Nintendo Switch. So you can see stood up. Yeah. So you've got you've got up to about there on the Joy-Con. So there you go. So just around halfway across the Joy-Con stick on the left. So there you go, that should give you a, a bit of an indication of the height. And in terms of the length, there's one switch length. And as you can probably see, that's not another full switch length. So we're talking about maybe a switch and a half in terms of length. There you go, how's that for accuracy? Now what do we have on the sides? Nice shiny surface. On this side though, look at this, there we go, we've got the line in, volume up and down, and power mode. On the back, you have majority slim Bluetooth audio soundbar. And then we have, oh, there we go. Look, there's an optical in as well. Ah, so there's the DC 12 volt power input, which means that this does need to be plugged in. It cannot be done with a USB. Uh, USB charge bank, power bank or anything like that. And there's the USB port if you want to put your own USB stick in with music on. Optical in if you have a fancy TV and fancy cable. But if you just want to do something like using a switch, you put the cable in there and attach to the switch. So, it's attached to the switch is a headphone port. So now what I need to do is I need to plug this in, get some power going to it. So I will do that in the next video. Okay, so thanks for watching this unboxing video of the Majority Bofell Compact Bluetooth soundbar. As you can see there, there's the name. Don't forget it, very good value. We'll give you some more details in the description. So be sure to like this video, subscribe to Cube3, press the little bell so you get notifications, and do leave us some comments. And I'll be back very shortly with another video that will show off its audio capabilities. Great, thanks for watching. Catch you again very soon.